Hi everyone, welcome back on Evoking Grace. For those who don't know me, I am Antonia Lyons. I'm an energy intuitive and a change facilitator. And I've created this online space for people like you and I who know that it's much, much more than what life appears to be. And I've been getting a few emails in the last couple of months from people telling me about their struggles, how hard it is for them to adjust to whatever has been happening both in their lives and in the world. And so I thought I'll share a few words which have helped me a great deal during the years and especially in the last six months. Because words are energy and when you use them wisely that can literally shift any dynamic you're in. So my first video was about and, the second video was about whoops, and you can watch those videos on my YouTube channel, Evoking Grace. And um, today, my final word is allow. And I love this word, I really do. And um, if there ever was a time to really allow ourselves to do things in a different way, is this. Because life as we know it has gone. It ain't coming back. And we can sit here and really dwell on it, telling one another how much we're missing it. The truth is, we've been asked to really start doing things in, in a different way. And that's going to be uncomfortable. And that's when allow comes in. And usually when people get in touch with me, it's because they want to make changes in their life. They want the big life. Some of them are very daring. They want the impossible. But for the impossible to happen, you gotta stay open for the impossible to come in. And most of the time we miss that. We're so busy, we're so stuck in the left side of our brain with the to-do lists and the right and wrong, the wants, the buts, that we don't allow ourselves to move into the right side of our brain, to get familiar with our intuition, with our wisdom, with our knowingness. And there is always a voice, whenever we feel stuck in our, in our life, there is always a voice at the back of our head inviting us to do things in a different way, try different things. And so allows, allow gives you the opportunity to stop playing with life. Things are no longer working as you, as you wanted them to work, as you thought they should work. You don't feel that comfortable with it, so start trying different things. Have fun till you get to a point when it is actually feeling comfortable, till you get to a point when you actually feel joy. Despite the bad day, it doesn't matter, but you're gonna feel joy, you're gonna feel comfortable in the new way. So allow is not about being meek or um, permissive. You're not going to let others treat you badly or life take you over. No, at all. You're going to trust yourself. You're going to trust that knowingness, that intuition that has been trying to talk to you forever. So when you start using and rather than but, when you're capable to stop whenever situations are not feeling comfortable and you just say, oops, this is not working anymore, I'm going to try things in a, in a different way, then you can allow yourself to really open up and to really start doing things in, um, in a new way. So if you enjoyed your time with me, check my YouTube channel, Evoking Grace, my website, hopeofkinggrace.com, to get your free video series on how the mind and heart always work together and make your life. But for now, from my little corner here in the city of London, much love and grace from my heart to yours. And have fun. Don't take yourself so seriously. <laughs> Laugh at yourself. Take care. Bye.